Brick Addicts Lego lovers, ladies and gentlemen and friends from all over the world, welcome to another episode update where today we're going to cover a few different things. So right now I am coming to you from my kitchen. In fact, I'm getting ready to do some cooking. Just figured I'd sit here at my counter. We're going to be doing uh, a lot of green screen stuff, kind of like we are right now. Uh, one of the cool things though is I'm going to be showing you guys how to green screen. There's the table I'm going to use. There's the background green screen. The key here is that the camera's over there. Uh, for example, in the Maersk video that we did, I had my arm hanging outside the truck and uh, this is what made that possible, right here. Hey Brick Addicts! You picked a great day to show up. I've been hired to drive the mayor's truck today. <sighs> it's easy. It's extremely easy and it's fun and you can put yourself inside Lego sets really anywhere. In fact, you know what? I haven't had a vacation in a while. Let's go to Paris. Oh, this is cool. This is Eiffel Tower? Really? Just, just like that? Hawaii. Beautiful. I'm gonna go swimming after this video. <laughs> um, let's see. Uh, London. Okay, okay. Let's go back to my kitchen now. Oh, hey, what you guys think of the uh, the contest? Look. Let me make this very clear, if you didn't win, don't worry, okay, because we're going to have another contest within the next couple weeks, and after that we're going to be running contests consecutively, and, um, you know, maybe you'll win then, or if you don't win the next one, maybe you win the one after that, or the one after that, so don't give up, there is always hope. We got one coming up that is going to show the uh, process of cleaning the Legos. So kind of some different stuff that we've never done before. Cleaning the Legos, sterilizing them, uh, putting soap and all this stuff on them, cleaning them real good, which we do. We sterilize any used part that comes in here. We're gonna show you the process of that. We're gonna be uh, covering very soon the Home Depot. We're gonna have a, uh, a a big thing on the Home Depot. So Home Depot has had many variations. We've gone through, you know, it, it wasn't big enough, so we made it a little bigger than we wanted it bigger than we realized, okay, if we go any bigger, it's gonna be too big. So I think we've got it perfect now. Now we're just toying with some of the uh, components. In fact, my kitchen is supposed to be one of the components that's supposed to go into the Home Depot, but I don't know. Tell me what you guys think. Here's a picture of how the kitchen component looks and how it would look if it was in the Home Depot. Is it too big or do you think that it's cool enough that it'll look just right inside the Home Depot? I've got mixed feelings about it, but I value your opinion and your comments. So please let me know what you think. Thank you so much for watching. We are a full service, very family friendly Lego channel. We try to do as many epic things as possible. So if you're not subscribed, please click that subscribe button. If you like the video, please smash that like button below without breaking your device. Share the video. Also, if you like vlogs, be sure to click right there. We go behind the scenes, show you all kinds of cool stuff. And if you like highly detailed Lego sets, be sure to click right there. Thank you all so much for watching. This has been a lot of fun, and we will see you in the next Brick Attic video. Have a wonderful day.